U.S. Federal Reserve has raised interest rates by 0.25%, its first increase in nine years. This was announced on Wednesday after a two-day policy meeting between officials with stocks rallying in early trading in Europe and the U.S. The rate which stands at 0.5% after the increase was kept the same throughout the global credit crunch so that the financial institutions could borrow cheaply and in turn allow them to lend at lower rates. The U.S. Central Bank cited as the reasons for its action increased household spending and investment by business along with a continued low rate of inflation. The bank also raised its projection for its economic growth next year slightly from 2.3% to 2.4%. That suggests the bank does not think the rate increase will damage growth. U.S. share markets jumped in response. The move is likely to cause ripples around the world. It could also mean higher borrowing costs for developing economies, many of which are already seeing slow growth. Much of what happens in India will depend on how foreign institutional investors react to the Fed hike. Foreign institutional investors have withdrawn nearly $2.5 billion from domestic markets since November in anticipation of a hike. See, we live in a global world. I mean, uh, no country can be insulated from international developments. What we are saying is that we are well prepared to deal with such external uh, uh, developments. But, and uh, we are well prepared to deal with such external developments. The country is benefiting out of, as I said, low crude prices and uh, the overall uh, macroeconomic stability is also there. Current account deficit and fiscal deficit are also under control. And this year, government is committed to maintaining 3.9% uh, fiscal deficit, notwithstanding the additional expenditure which has been undertaken as a part of the supplementary demands which have been presented in the parliament.